still differentiated like a true planet. We believe that the solar system received an extra slug of radioactive aluminum and iron from a nearby supernova explosion at the time when Vesta was forming, explains Russell. These materials decay and give off heat. As the asteroid was gathering material up into a ball of rock, it was also trapping the heat inside itself. As Vesta's core melted, lighter material rose to the surface, forming volcanoes, mountains, and lava flows. We think Vesta had volcanoes and flowing lava at one time, although we've not yet found any ancient volcanoes there, says Russell. We're still looking. Vesta's plains seem similar to Hawaii's surface, which is basaltic lava solidified after flowing onto the surface. Vesta has so much in common with the terrestrial planets. Should it be formally reclassified from asteroid to dwarf planet? That's up to the International Astronomical Union. But at least on the inside, Vesta has characteristics similar to the terrestrial planets. If anyone asks Russell, he knows how he would vote. For more